YouTube. It's your girl, Allie. Allie Dre to be exact. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Send your mama, your daddy, your granny, your auntie. Send everybody by way. But you, yes you, do not forget to thumbs this video, comment, and share. Let's get into this look. <laughs> me want to get started on youtube i actually wanted to start a youtube channel back in 2009 i believe it was no not 2009 i had my child in 08 so it had to be 2010 when i got my first apartment and that's when cut that's when color shadow started popping i actually i actually used to film videos and i actually uploaded a video and then i took it down because at that time i wasn't as confident and I wasn't really in the right space at that time to, you know, just give my all to it. But that's neither here or there. Your girl is, your girl's ready now. We, we about to be in these streets. <laughs> we out you, baby. Where we at? We outside. We out. <laughs> we about to be in these streets. But I'm going to start off with my brows. And I'm going in with a Wet n Wild pencil. This is in Pretty Neat. And I'm just going to outline my brows, shape them how I like it. How I like to do it. Um, a little bit about me. I am a very bubbly person. Life of the party. <laughs> um, I am in the Carolinas. They look like putting it down for my on the south side, North Carolina, South Carolina. So if you're ever in South Carolina, are close by and would like your makeup done, hit up your girl. Freelance makeup artist, I am currently, well, I mean, it don't matter where I'm at in South Carolina. I'll get to you, boo-boo. Just, you know, book your girl. But go ahead and check out my business page, Allie Drain Effect. That's A-L-L-I-E-D as in dog, R-A-I-N-A-F-F-E-C-T. And go ahead and like those um, pictures and share them, please. Your girl is here. So I actually did um, a couple of vlog videos. I uh, I don't know how I feel about those vlogs that I did. I, I just, I really don't know how I feel about them. I do know that I, um, I recently ordered the iPhone 13. I actually have it. I need to get that up and running. <laughs> Let me set my tea. I need to get that up and running. And I, that's what I'm going to use to start filming my videos. I've I'm undecided. I see two cameras that I really want, but I haven't decided decided on which one I really, really want to get into. This is the LA Girl Pro Concealer, and this is in the color Pure Big Jean. And I'm just going to conceal these brows up. Go ahead and define them the way that it best fits you. What works for you. But um, right now, I'm just... I'm, I'm at a point in my life where I'm just focusing on me and doing what's best for me and what makes me happy. Not anybody else, but what makes me happy. So, um, I love entertaining. That's anybody that knows me knows that for a fact, I love to entertain. And like I said, YouTube is something that I've been wanting to do for a while. So I've decided to, why not? Let's get into YouTube. And I have two little ones my oldest actually is into tech stuff so he's actually the one that's going to be editing my videos and helping me out and you know we're just at that in a genre where we invest in our kids so for me it's like why not start youtube i got somebody who can help me with editing my videos and you know i want to get into um like vlogging and stuff like that I have somebody who can follow me around. So not only am I doing what I love, I'm also investing in my child to build his um, skills in the things that he liked to do. So, and we all know these brows are not twins, but they are sisters. So we're just gonna go ahead and get her together. So I play around with my brows until I get them exactly how I want them. 
I see why people do their brows off camera because, honey, this ain't something you need to be talking. You don't need to be talking while you're doing your brows. Let's get into this other one. Those are the brows. That's what we're working with. My foundation. And we're going to use Maybelline Fit Me. And this is in 340. I don't know. Like, your girl got to get into this YouTube thing on how to get the stuff to pick up. But that's that. Yeah. This is the Matte Poreless. Y'all, don't be sleeping on the drugstore. Okay? Matter of fact, don't be sleeping on Maybelline. Because, listen... Maybe she's Maybelline. Maybe, no, maybe she's Maybelline. <laughs> maybe it's Maybelline. So I'm going in with the wet spoolie. This is, um, dang, I forgot the name of it, but I did get it from Walgreens. So that's the base that we're going to have. We're going to go back with our um, LA Girl Fit Me. And we are going to do some ooh, highlighting. I'm going to highlight under the eye. I see people that highlight here now or just here, but I'm still old school with it. So, you know, I just, I just flat it everywhere. Oh, this, that's flat. That's, that's flat. That, um, sponge, you know, um, shine free loose with this, um, sponge that I also picked up from Walgreens. And we're gonna go ahead and start highlighting. This is actually my go-to look when I don't want to do eyeshadow. Dark. This is dark to deep. And I'm going to go in with this color right here. So we're going to put a little life back to this face. That's what we're about to do. And I like to take that all the way around. Look at that. Look how I messed that up. But we can fix that. So right here, where I actually put the contour and it touches my brow, it's a little flat brush. Take a little foundation product that I have off the back of my hand. And we are going to fix that up. Clean that up, back it up just a little bit. It's only right. Back that up just a little bit. I'm just going to dot up my nose to make sure it's not too dark and we are going to I am we're gonna go ahead and go in with powder and I'm gonna show you a trick on them brows on how to keep them brows right sis super stay full coverage and this is 355 i think it said coconut because it has nut at the end it's maybe hazelnut but i think it was coconut i believe it was coconut duh on the back sis yeah 355 coconut yeah right between the contour and the brow and i actually like to go on top of my brows with the foundation close my eyelid set everything that's in there and then whatever's left, I just swipe one time and down. That's what we're working with. I actually like to go ahead and put the glue on my lashes. These are the Adele Wispy Lash, Whisk B Lashes. I actually like to use these on my clients only because they are, I don't, they're perfect. Like they're the perfect thickness, the perfect size. Some people get intimidated, like my older clients, they get intimidated by it. But once I put them on, they're like, oh, they look so natural. Yes, sis, I got you, boo. I got you. I'm going to use both of these, actually. So this one is a black radiance, but this is medium. This is light to medium. Light to medium. But I'm going to use this one right here for the bridge of my nose and under my brows. And then on the dark, deep one, I'm going to actually use this highlight right here for my cheek, the no, bridge of my nose with that one. Oh, she pretty, pretty. 
And I guess as I get used to YouTube, I, I guess I can get this. I don't know. It's the lighting. I got to get this lighting done because with this, I am filming on my iPhone 10. And when I move, I can see that it has to adjust and it's bright and then it like, yeah, I don't like that. Sis, I need you to stay right here. Stay focused. Stay focused. Don't worry about what they're going to do. Don't think about what you're going to do. Just do it. I don't remember how it go, but I know it's something like that. <laughs> Get under my eyes. Go in with that um, dark to deep highlight, and we're just gonna highlight right on the cheekbones because it actually complements the. So this is Elf Clear Mascara. It's clear. It has, but it says brow and it says brow on one side, lash on another. But it is a clear brow and lash mascara. I love these things. I get them from Walgreens. Old Navy usually has it in the little, um, when you're in line, you know how they try to get you to buy all them little things. They get me every time. But I always buy these. I always buy at least um, five of them. No matter where I'm at, I stock up on them. But these are a must. I actually have, it's like this side is a little darker. Both sides are clear when you buy it. This side is darker because I use the last side. I like that brush. I use it on my brows. And then the brow side is what I use when I don't have on makeup. But at least my brows look presentable. So, and don't forget to take that little clear part out, sis, when you get to the bottom so you can get all your product. Don't throw it away. With that powder, this is why I like to go over my brows with powder. So I can um, shape them with this clear, we'll put a coat on top of them with this clear um, mascara. And that's how I get my brows to stay in place and they don't go nowhere. Don't move. It don't move my hair. Don't move. You see this here? They don't move. They don't move. So that's our brow. So we got our brow highlight. Your lashes. But first we're gonna coat our lashes with this Maybelline Rocket Volume Express. And I actually have the color hmm, very black. So we're gonna go ahead and coat our brows. And we'll go ahead and use our Revlon tweezers. And we're going to go ahead and put the whisk, whisk bees on. And you can look up, you can look down, whichever way works for you. Just put your lashes on. And I like to get mine as close to that waterline. Not waterline, because I think the bottom one's called waterline. But close to the line as possible and coat the bottom lashes to bring some light to the bottom Milani the tank eyeliner and this bad boy is sharp y'all excuse me and we're just gonna I'm not gonna do a wing liner I'm just going to coat where my lash meets my um top eye for falsies. So that it looks more natural and it blends. That's one side. I have LA Girl Lip Pencil. And this is a natural. This is LA Girl Lip Pencil and she's a natural. I did use this um, Sheer Moisture. That's what I coated my lips with before we even got started on this look I'm going to fill in my lip with this pencil so we just colored it and we are going to fill it in with this natural pencil And she is like the perfect, perfect shade for my lips. 
but you know a lip is not complete without the gloss <laughs> gotta gloss her up so this is actually not from walgreens this is from the hair store and this is crystal gloss and it is yeah she been around she been around look at that get into her let's see what we can get with this hair because your girl didn't put a she did not put a comb over here yes yes yes